Yes, and I think it's a great calling that's coming uh, fast. Mm -hmm. Like a locomotive train that can't be stopped. It is. In, in the new transformation mm -hmm. on the planet. Mm -hmm. And it is a consciousness. It is a consciousness. It's a new thought consciousness. Yes. There's, there's communication skills and tactics mm -hmm. and resources that go along with it. And I think that's what I think our commonality is mm -hmm. coming out today. And it just happens to be in the place where people meet in a hotel. Uh -huh. Yeah, in hotels. <laughs> and you know what else, too? I think there's a big, um, another, I'm going to call it a halo movement. This recent, this just arrived. Okay. A halo movement in hotels for continuing higher educa uh, education with fun. It has to be fun. Life is lived like a paid vacation. Now, now yes. that you're living your dream. Yes. 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 Right. And that's what I choose to do as well. You do as well. We were talking about that. How you and I both kind of feel as though we are retired. When you do choose to do what you, what your calling is, when you choose to enjoy life, you will be fine. You will make money. You, the universe will provide for you. And unfortunately, most people choose to be paid slaves. That's what they choose to do. Uh, and that's one of the things I think you and I both want to kind of help other people achieve so that we can all transition to where we're going. And stop being paid slaves. Stop being slaves to anything. Because it's, it's all about choices. Well, it costs us so much more. So much more. <laughs> so much more. So where are you going? When? Now. <laughs> <laughs> Do you mean tonight? <laughs> where are you going? What does success mean to you? Oh, success. Yeah. Personally, what do I want to do if, yes. if I had to... If Angels at God Central Station can ask you, what does success mean to Daniel? I would love to, if I had to say yes, my life was a success. For example, if, 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 if next year, because I think, you know, if next year I had, to, I had to choose to move along to another plane and say yes, my life was or wasn't successful. I think success to me personally is having made a difference in articulating what's going on, spreading the word, helping people understand what we already know. You know what I mean? Have people put into words the, co the shift in consciousness that's already taken place uh, and be a, a vehicle for spreading information. That's my job. And if I could touch lots of people and help people understand and wake up and live like we were talking, as we were saying, a vacation. Well, live their dreams. Daniel, I wasn't scheduled to be here today, for heaven's sake. Mm -hmm. Wasn't scheduled to be here. And when I jumped out of bed this morning because being in touch with my authentic alignment guides and directs me that I move on it with or without anybody's permission now. Sometimes without my own permission. Uh -huh, right. <laughs> and that's how we ended up. Uh, for the second time within five days. Mm -hmm. Miraculously. It is miraculous. Happy coincidence. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So, what am I willing to give up today? Ah, yes. What are you willing to give up to get it? <laughs> what? Yeah. What are you? What did you give up today? I gave up. You give up besides your whole day, which is precious. A fast-paced locomotion. I don't want that. I want to continue to take time to breathe. The mm -hmm. breath and to appreciate life and be and fall in love every day because I live it in the pure presence of the now. I live that. Now. And that's what and people fall in love with. You. No. <laughs> and well, that's why they fall in love with you too. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. so, what goes on in the inside goes on on the outside. That sure does. That's you exactly said that. right. Yes. You said that. Yeah. Whatever's going on on the inside shows on the outside. Yes. And that's one of Dr. Kim, a good friend of ours. Yes. Talks about that a lot. Yes. If you're a mess on the outside, you're a mess on the inside. And if you're whatever's going on on the inside shows on the outside. Period. So people who need to get it together on the inside. And, and when I think I, I when I think I flunked the self-discovery class for for writing my first paper that began with um, I feel like I'm turning my life inside out. <laughs> I flunked. <laughs> Would you believe I flunked that? <laughs> you know, I failed. I was told that I failed when I was first entering the, when I was first starting in my career. Uh, my career was in finance at the time. I was told several times that I kept failing the personality test that you had to take to get these jobs. And I remember thinking, how can you fail a personality test? Well, I did. Mm -hmm. 
Good thing that's go. gone and passed. Uh huh. Because <laughs> you're still number one. That's right. <laughs> I just saw that on that guy's uh, T-shirt that just walked in. <laughs> See, the messages are all around us. Uh huh. They are. Yeah, inside and out. So where are we going from this? Success or not? That's what we were talking about. Success. Success. Well, we were talking about where am I going, what is successful. I have no idea. And, and that's true. I don't know how I'm going to be used in this process. Uh, so I really don't know. We were talking about that before. I don't know. exactly. The only thing I know is that I don't know. However, I know that I will be fine as long as I do what I'm supposed to be doing, which is passing along the information. And everybody has their different job. That's my job. Well, and you're, use, you're utilizing your divine gifts. All of you. All, you are using all of you to share in, in a big, in a larger venue that I see. And that's why I was honored and enthusiastic about supporting you and helping you, you to get there. Because you know what? What goes around comes around. That's in the right. circle of life. And yes. we're all here for it. For the, to help one another and to partner and to learn how to use those communication and technical skills. And I'm working on it too. We all are, yeah. <laughs> right? I'm learning how to be human. What can I say? Mm -hmm. Every day is a learning experience. Mm -hmm. More so. Mm -hmm. And that's a switch. Learning mm -hmm. how to be human versus learning how to be spiritual. So true. Mm -hmm. That's right, because we're spiritual beings having a human experience, right? That's all I know. Mm -hmm. That's all I know. And, uh, I think our time's about up, but I have one last question. Mm -hmm. Angel food. What are you going to do with angel food? Oh, angel food. Yes, yeah. that's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> do you mean literally, am I going to be making my angel food cakes? Well, yeah. Uh, you know what I thought was strange? In Mexico, where I live, in Guadalajara, they don't have angel food cake. And uh, it's one of the things that I saw on your list of things was angel food. And I thought, well, that's interesting because I'm creating angel food. Uh, so someday soon, when you go to Guadalajara, you should be able to see angel food cake on the street. Right now, it's something has to do with the altitude. It's very high up, so it's more difficult to make them. However, we have found a way to overcome that, and we are going to make angel food cakes. And uh, 